The video of the uh, smart carton or paper pack um, that's going to be used for the shipment of um, groceries. Um, the product is currently shipped in a, uh, a normal uh, RSC case. It's actually been Nuna tab, which means that when you fold it over, erected, it's, um, the flaps are downward, so it doesn't get in the way of the operator. Um, ours arrives exactly the same. However, what we do is we laminate a special paper on the inside of the box that is going to actually separate the fragile items, items that we have over here, um, from the heavier items such as glass, tin, um, heavy milk and, and detergents as such. Currently, a lot of these are packed um, with other protective packaging then they go in the box and then they're shipped, which obviously is time consuming and costly. So what we're going to do is we're going to um, use this box to eliminate the need for all that. So first thing that we're going to do is the, the uh, items are actually sorted and they come down and the person simply puts them into the box like so. So the heavier items would go into the box. These are jars. We're not going to put any extra packing around them, although they normally do have extra packing. Um, then what we're going to do, and it, we're going to hope that this doesn't have to be in any particular order, these flaps would then come up like so. This is the internal paper, not the flaps of the actual the box itself. And then on, on this side, we're going to actually, once we've got the full heavier items in here, we're going to take the paper and we're going to actually fold the paper around these items. Like so. We're going to fold this right the way around. We've now created a barrier. Now the light items would go in. So we're just going to put those in like so. And as you can see here, we've even got eggs that go in as well. We've got some fruit that will go in here. Um, obviously it could be filled up. Um, wouldn't really matter where they would go. Put the whole thing in. Um, apples and what have you as well. Then what happens is, we've done it so that the box will then adjust down. This would go around. Then what happens is, this actually adjusts down to the height of the product inside the box. So now what's going to happen is it wraps itself around, put the minor ones down first, like so. The major ones come over. And then what we do is we take complete box shut. Like so. Now what you've done is then you've actually clamped the whole thing together. So nothing can actually move inside. One of the problems when you're just shipping even in a normal box is you've got that air movement. This can't move at all. As you can hear as I lift that up and down, nothing can move. It's held a lot better than if you've actually just got what we're going to do now is we're going to actually drop this box um, a few times. Like so. Like so. And like so. Now that's obviously much more severe drop than would actually happen going through the internal shipping process. What we're now going to do is this would be when the customer gets it. They open it up. And as you can see, if you want to look inside the box, the items are all there. The most important ones are things like the eggs. As you can see, none of the eggs are broken. The other ones that are very delicate are like the raspberries. Also, these yogurts have a tendency, these are normally putting a little corrugated out of. We've not done any of that. As you can see, the tops here are easy to puncture. Nothing's punctured there. Nothing's punctured here. Tomatoes the same. Also, bananas are just in a normal bag like you would get. No different. And then the heavier items, which are in the bottom here, 
are open, as you can see, all of those. The milk, not leaking. The canned goods, the glass. That's everything. And then obviously from the point of view of the customer, there's no loose fill. So as all they would simply do is take the box, the paper is laminated on the inside, obviously it's 100% all paper. You simply take the box and then to get rid of the box, fold it down in the recycling. That's it, that's all you'd have. So that is a video of the SmartCant adjustable height all paper pack for the shipment of groceries.